In this video, I'll go through how you can create your free account or free tier account on, on you know, on all like four major public cloud service provider which are AWS, Azure, GCP and Oracle. So first I am going through AWS one. So what you need to do, uh, you know, search Google search like AWS free tier or AWS free account. Then you will see that there is an option, you know, that Amazon Web Services and you start a free tier account. So you just click on there. Now here you can see the option there uh, like uh, let me zoom that little bit. So here you can see the types of offer like free what is that free trials 12 months free enjoy these offers 12 months free and always free so there is you can get you know more those details like you know, what is free or uh, like 12 months free you can filter that on which are 12 months free you can filter from side you can check which is always free and based on different category and and the trial information like you see that here machine learning two months so you can get little more here so, but the thing is what you need to do to create that account account is here is the sign up here so create a free account so um, i'll go through you know the options and so that you know what you have to do because i have already used multiple accounts and i don't have the um, you know the option for now but um, what you need to do here you have to pass your you know the like root user email address the email address you're going to use and then the account name uh, after that you need to select that verify email address when you verify email address it will send you a verification code so based on your email address that you're going to provide you have to verify that one then after verification um, then it will prompt you know you know next page where you need to pass all your personal information and uh, and finally it will ask you your credit card details so where you know that after credit card details it will ask you to verify again uh, with the verify code and then you will see that there's a plan option that what kind of plan you want so definitely you know when you're learning when you are new into cloud you know that um, so you can select uh, free options and finally you know you will get a page to log in so and how the page will be finally you know, after logging in if i go to my console connection so let me uh, log in back here so when you get in there you will get the page like this so you can do sign in and as a root user you can use your account here and the password you provided and because i set up multi-factor authentication that for it is asking me here to pass that you know multi-factor authentication code so um, i'm going to check that authentication code like you can use some you know there are different authenticator tool and um, you can set that up so then you can log into the system and you see all those options that is available here you know which are always free or not free like mm, as an example if i go to ec2 and try to launch an instance from there 
here you see the free tier eligible so those things you can use there so free tier eligible free tier eligible so uh, that for aws now let me show you how you can do you know like uh, set up a free account uh, for azure cloud so for that uh, similar you can search for azure free account and you see that create your azure free account today so if you click there you'll get a page like this so there is a you know that it is giving the option okay that popular services free for 12 months and you can see all the services like view all services down below you can see all the services in a different months 12 months which are you know that they are up to your credit keep getting free services so there are free services which are available that you can use but they give you option that you can use 200 dollar us dollar credit for 30 days that you can use that one in addition to free services so how you will create an account here so you need to click on start free when you do that one it will ask you you know to verify your information like your name and an address verify through phone then you know finally after this phase it will ask you your credit card details so credit card details um, uh, what it will do it will charge you know one dollar uh, and you will get back that money again this is mainly to verify your account and when you are in then you can um, you know get the console for login and you can log in there so how that console access will be let me log into my account and show you what that i need to go to portal.azure.com using my account then password yes so i'm logging in there then you can use your service and you know then you can see which is available you got credit 200 dollar and you can and that is 200 us dollar like here you know this is Australian dollar so now let's go through similar thing within google cloud so for google cloud you need uh, to have a gmail account so let me go there to my gmail account and show you how actually that works so for gmail account when you go gcp account you just search for google cloud free account then it's the cloud.google.com if you click there and you see the um, here it's giving the information the good thing is here you can see that it has got more credit 300 dollar free credits plus if you click there it's for 90 days so three months so with google cloud you're getting 90 days so that's the good thing but you need you know your um, uh, gmail account and uh, down below that's you can see all those options free tier products which are free tier under free tier so you can get more information down below on that but again yeah, when you're going to set up account it will ask you all those you know, information plus credit card details so here yeah, and then you see the console if you click on console it will go to google cloud console and it's you know project specific then you can get the details on left side last uh, let me go through oci in console which is oracle cloud um, infrastructure console so let me go there so you can again search with a uh, oracle uh, free cloud here so um, 
after that uh, when you search for okay no better search button will help i think yeah so oracle filter cloud filter and search anything that will also go to the same page so here you see that oracle cloud if you click that one I'm not, I'm not, this is not the right page cloud feed there so you can go there and here you see that it start for free so um, uh, and you got you know there are there is one good thing that here always free services so um, uh, and what you will get all these free services you can see here that to oracle autonomous database uh, that has got an apex and a skill developer and uh, two amd compute vms and up to four instances uh, uh, with you know how many CO, o cpu or hours per month plus uh, object storage and but it has got you know that 300 cloud credit uh, thing is like like as you like us 200 dollar and that was 30 days so that's 30 days and google cloud it has got um, uh, three months um, and with aws a uh, specific credit part uh, there is a uh, one month you know there is a many uh, services that you can use uh, you did not specify that one and what are always free you can get more details here so um, yes if you would like to play please go through you know the free cloud and play so that you will come to know uh, what all those uh, cloud you know means and what the public cloud service are providing different services so um, uh, that is very much it uh, if you like this video please share and subscribe thank you thanks for watching